Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel and thank you for watching. The Champions League is back. Tuesday and Wednesday, we have so many games. And can you believe it? Chelsea are not in the Champions League, not in Europa League, not in Conference League. They are staying home. Incredible, right? But it is what it is. So we're going to be live on Soccer IQ YouTube channel. We're going to start very early. The first game between AC Milan and Newcastle United. And in the evening, we have other games. So we're going to be very, very busy on Tuesday and uh, Wednesday. Live on Soccer IQ YouTube channel. The link is going to be in the description down below call in show as always we always give the link for everybody no exception you just click on the link join us you can be my pundit <laughs> and comment the game together so you can join us before the games during the games and after the games so we we're gonna be there for hours don't forget soccer iq youtube channel the link is going to be in the description down below. Who do you think is going to win the Champions League 2023-2024? Do you think Manchester City are going to do it again? Or you think Real Madrid are going to be back again? PSG maybe? You know? Manchester United? Why not? Newcastle or Napoli? It's still open. Okay? So keep an up. An open mind on this one because this is football. You can't script football. Anyways, my friend. I'm going to go very quickly and predict all the games on Tuesday and also on Wednesday. Feel free to get in the comment section down below and predict your games and your result all right so let me start by milan against newcastle united very very good game of football newcastle won their last game in the premier league ac milan got destroyed by inter it was like 5-1 or something like that but i think at san siro milan against Newcastle, it's going to be 2-2 two -two draw. Moving on very quickly. Young boys against RB Leipzig. It's going to be one for young boys and two for Leipzig. I think Leipzig got more quality than young boys. 2-1 to Leipzig. Barcelona against Royal Antep from Belgium. This one is going to be 3-1 to FC Barcelona. Moving on. Feyenoord against Celtic. I think it's going to be 1-0 to Feyenoord. Lazio against Atleti Madrid. Very attacking football from Mauricio Sarri against Simeone Park the Bus. I'm afraid it's going to end up by being 1-1 at the end. Moving on. Manchester City against uh, Red Star Belgrade. They changed their name. I know that, but I can't pronounce that name. So I'm going to call them by their old name, which is Red Star. I think Manchester City are going to smash them 5-0. PSG against Borussia Dortmund. I think PSG are going to win 2-1 at home. Not going to be an easy game, but I think with Dembele... Kylian Mbappe, I think PSG are stronger than Dortmund.
Shakta against Porto. This one, correct me if I'm wrong, but Shakta are not even playing home. They have to play in another country. So it's going to be a very difficult game for them. It's going to be 1-1 one -one between Shakta and Porto. Let's move on and talk about the games on Wednesday. Galatasaray against Copenhagen. Galatasaray are going to win this one 2-0. The atmosphere in the stadium is going to be loud. The loudest stadium in the world. Galatasaray got one of the best fans in the world. I think it's going to be 2-0. Hakim Ziyech to score and also Icardi. Moving on. Real Madrid against Union Berlin. It's going to be 2-1 to Real Madrid. And I, I wish that Datro Fofana can score a goal for Union Berlin. Real Madrid don't have like a clinical, clinical number nine, but they can find goals from somewhere. Arsenal against PSV. Emirates Stadium, London. This one is going to be 2-2. Two, two. Yeah, the Gunners, they are flying in the Premier League at the moment, but they are not that convincing. They're just winning games. But that's what you need sometimes. You just need three points, right? Bayern Munich against Manchester United. It's going to be 3-0 to Bayern Munich. Manchester United are in crisis at the moment with a lot of injuries and, and suspension. Jadon Sancho suspended and also Anthony suspended by the club. <laughs> All right. Benfica against RB Salzburg. Benfica are going to beat them 3-1. Braga against Napoli. I think Braga are going to lose at home 1-2. Victor Osimhen to score two goals for Napoli. Moving on. Real Sociedad against Inter. Inter are in very, very good form at the moment. They completely destroyed AC Milan the other day. So I think they're going to win this game away 3-1. And the last game of Wednesday is going to be between Sevilla and FC Lens from France. I think it's going to be a draw 1-1. Now is your turn, my brother and sister, to get in the comment section down below and let me know your predictions and let's keep the conversation going. And don't forget that we're going to be live Soka IQ YouTube channel for all the games. So all you have to do, put your notification on and then when I'm live, you click on the link, call us, and have your say. We don't have to talk about the Champions League only. We can talk about the weather. <laughs> we can talk about the crisis at Chelsea Football Club or Manchester United. Or why not MLS and Leo Messi? You know, while we are watching the game together, we are talking football between friends. That's what we do there. We don't comment word by word. We're just watching together. And having fun. God bless. Think outside the box. And see you next time.